welcome back. This is Lenae Dorfel, the Good Hygienist, coming to you live from In Practice. Welcome to our topic for the week, which is maintenance of teeth whitening. I'm so glad that you tuned in. If you haven't and you joined us now for the first time, welcome. I hope that you will find this helpful and even if it just leads you down a conversation path to me to help you with advice, um, feel free to do so. Right, the biggest secret with anything aesthetic that you're more mark or that you are, makes you pretty um, is expensive and needs maintenance. It's actually like an investment. So you have to look after your investments. So you have to look after your teeth in any case. So why not invest in your teeth? Brilliant, I did maths today. That is a plus. Some tips that I can give you is that you can buy our in-house brand. See how quick that was? It's native by my. Okay, the good foam. Okay, so the good foam is a two-in-one whitening foam toothpaste. Even though, even though I branded it as a whitening toothpaste, I prefer using it as a mouthwash. After I flossed and brushed, then rinse, brush my tongue, and then I will use my good foam. All right, that's my everyday, twice a day maintenance habit. The advantage of that as a maintenance option is that you will see on the little holder it says two in one. Okay, the number one for it is that it keeps your whitening white because there's an active ingredient in it, hydrogen peroxide. Remember the two. The second advantage is that it is antibacterial. Okay, so uh, you will have a cleaner mouth and calculus, block, staining, all of that will take way longer to form on your teeth. Other maintenance tips, you can have your coffee drinking through a straw if you if you buy going to buy a, a takeaway coffee cup buy one with a straw okay just watch your temperature just have it a little bit a little bit cooler you know you don't want the greater palate and when you are in a restaurant and you don't have like you don't want to sit with your cappuccino and a massive cardboard straw that's like my worst dream ever a cardboard straw in a cappuccino so when you have coffee or tea. It is so wise to rinse with water afterwards and then as soon as you rinse and spit out you just take your top teeth and run it over your tongue like this and then you spit the little ball into the basin and you're gonna go uh, for yourself because it's gonna be brown. Okay hot chocolate, Milo, those two as well or anything that can stain your teeth. All right if it can stain a white shirt don't have it. Until next time. Love you guys. Bye. Um, uh, wee, wee. Okay. Got. Uh, we not. In the rebuild. As more of a mouth rush. Oh, rush. <laughs> Okay. Is that is it? And it. Blah, 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 blah. God.